Hey, what's up, soldiers? My name is Grang FPS, the Zombies Extraordinaire. And as you guys know, I've been doing the achievement series where I go on a specific map and complete all the challenges for that map. Well, some of the challenges are above and beyond more difficult. Like on transit, you have to open all the doors without being lit on fire, for example. So also Buried has a challenge that everyone said was really difficult. And that is the Awaken the Gazebo challenge, where you have to pack a bunch on round one without using the bank or the weapons locker. So that's what I have for you guys today hope you enjoy the video and without further ado let's jump right into it time for buried let's get it we're gonna do awaken the gazebo first which is probably one of the hardest ones we gotta get this one done first because i feel like it's gonna be the hardest Dang it, man. I can't make the, I don't know what it is. Like if I'm playing this map and like doing a challenge or something, I can't make what? the jump. It's not done but yet. when I'm like just casually playing it, I make it every time. It's crazy. All right, we're going to make this jump this time. There we go. Made the jump. Let's go. All right. Now we'll get a gun. That's for you. Cause it's like the best gun in the game can get the 300 additional points per kill there's one two two zombie kills so far let's open up arthur now there you go arthur what does that tell you that zombie got whack broke some shit way to go all right, we can get two more kills. Two. I have such bad aim. Okay, we did not get the booze there. All right, so we can't kill any more zombies. So now we gotta use wall buys and booze. So Arthur, you gotta be got to be perfectly accurate i swear to god do not run into the wall this is what you want okay, i think this one's good yep nice 1720 points for that one now this is the hardest one to hit opening this debris Okay, Arthur, I swear, do not go too far to the left or right. Just go perfectly straight, please. Hope you know not to bite the hand that feeds you. Got it. Let's go, Arthur. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So now we have the wall buys available to us. To get Talk more points to hey that's not a bad, not idea. bad idea i know every buried quote by heart almost i think <laughs> all right so, so we I gotta go do that one junk. another weapon i guess i'll pdw is pretty decent so we're gonna draw this one at the top of the saloon and then we're gonna jump across and turn on power so far we have not spent any points except buying the svu but we got a thousand points for drawing it so kind of worked out all right and we draw it in this room right or out here Seven thousand points let's jump and turn on power okay power's on now now we can buy more booze Ooh, don't you dare miss arthur help us out right ah! perfect goaded on the sticks hey you broke some shit. all right way to go fella we should be able to do it right now we just have to have him open up this and we already have enough points so we'll just do it close to make sure that we don't mess at all if we miss, that would kind of suck. Hey, you wanna be careful what you put in your body, pal. Me, I know. 
All right. There we go. Now we just have to go through the witch's house without getting hit. See if we can do it. I'm going so cautiously. I do not trust it. Oh, you, that ghost went all sneaky on me, dude. All right. I'm not going to grab the free perk because that's an achievement. Actually, why not? Screw it. I'm really not sure what that meant. Ectoplasmic residue. All right. So that is getting a free perk on buried, obviously. And of course, the maze is not great, but it's over here, so we're good. And all we have to do is pack a bunch and we're done. The hardest achievement, I would say. Besides maybe the round 21 in the maze. Easy peasy. Awaken the gazebo. All right. Awesome. Starting off strong, baby. That's what I like to see. All right. So we got that one out of the way. Now it's time to do a bunch of other achievements.